Hello everybody, it's Suffolk Blue, all the way from merry old England. How the devil are you? I hope you are well. Welcome back to Wednesday's episode in our week-long adventure of City Skylines. Um, my birthday week, celebrating my one-year anniversary as a YouTuber. Um, we are playing City Skylines. Last time we put in the Cornfield Estate, finished that off. The Widden Estate sort of panned that out a little bit. Still got a lot of problems with uneducated workers. We don't have enough stupid people in this town. It's just too clever. Um... We've obviously put in a huge area for officers, but we had just started last episode, and we are going to continue in this episode of putting in our main train track. So, uh, again, we're going to take the train track all the way from here. I think what we're going to have to do... Oops, I don't want to do that. Where's my curvy worthies? I think what we're going to have to do is to... Oops, why you not turn? Why you not turn? Turn like that. Okay, well, I want you to turn... Quite nice though, because you're sort of going to come past the past the reservoir. You're coming via train, via reservoir. Did that work? Yeah. I'm going to curve it around. Coming it around the, the reservoir. Oh, we want it to cut across there, really. I wonder, let me see. Let's go back. Let's put our straight line on and take this track straight out. Uh, no, I don't want to destroy it. Dead straight. And then what we want to do is come over, um, over this road. So if, can I do a page up here? Type of job I can. Straight over the over the middleway. Page down. There we go. And then we can put a curve on, I think. want to do is curve that around. So let's just get rid of this bit. Back to curve. Bang! There we go. So, we've got, right over the top of our murder way, a little... That looks a bit steep to me, that hill. I if I can make that a bit less steep. to about here and then page down how does that look oh that's better that's a slightly more serene bend and then I really just want you to connect I didn't really need that and, that. and let's go back to here is. Bit of a tight curve, straight up over the bridge, and then you have the long straight run into Greenhaven Station, which is right in the centre of town. And then what we can then do is this line will carry on off this side and join up over here. So it becomes sort of one long route in. Pretty good. Let's just see, has that got water? Yeah, you've got water and electricery. We haven't put any bus... <laughs> we haven't put any bus station stops in. And I do need to put a bus stop outside this station to link it up. Um, I'll do that off... Do you know whether you want to keep seeing me put bus lines in? But I'm going to have to do it, I think. The whole point of this is for you to see me play this game. So I'm going to play this game. 
We are going to start. We can create a new line directly from that rail station if we wanted to. But I think we're going to go... I think we're going to start a new line from here. From outside the... Just opposite the other one. So, buses from here. We're create, creating a new line. And we're just going to go straight down. So, one... Two, three. Oh, that's good. We don't have any bus stops on this one, do we? Four and around, up and there, down. And there. I don't mind them doubling up a little bit on some of the areas. I just don't want them sort of constantly hitting other bus stops because it doesn't help. And I think the important thing is we're going to have to come up this way. Uh, let's stop there. We'll come down this route. To there. We can't put a bus stop directly outside the train station, apparently. As annoying as that is. Round 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 there I wish I could go um how to go how to go I'm going to go right up the hill. I'm going to go right up the road. Uh, we're, going, we're going the really, really long way around. And then all the way down. There it is. <laughs> what a bus route. <whistles> That's a big one. But it will help, I think, just linking more of this together. Um, we need to name it and do all the bits and pieces. Uh, that one. That one. Uh, this is, um, I suppose, this is the downtown and station line. Downtown the station, itchy head. Um, and we're going to colour this. I don't really know. We've got so many lines now. Bright blue, something like that. Yeah, we haven't got that one yet. Bright blue. Done. So, the railway station is in. It's connected. Let's make that start off again. And we shall see. We have got a new bus line now, as well, connecting all that together. Look at the buses that are piling out of here. This junction is always going to be a problem for these buses now, isn't it? I mean, it's only letting one bus out at a time. Why is priority being given to this route? Oh, that's a squirt of buses come out of there.
Hmm. I might have to upgrade. Looking at this road. Well, I don't know. It's sort of getting itself in a, some sort of order. It's taking a while, but it certainly seems to be getting itself into some sort of order. Well, yeah, there's clear road now in front of them, pretty much. The, the teal buses, the, the station line will be getting out of the way in a minute anyway, so you won't even notice them. Again, I think it's sometimes it's just because you start off that process of a new line and all these buses pile out that it just crams everything up. But actually, give it a couple of seconds to get itself into some sort of order. And maybe it doesn't look too bad after all. Have we had any trains come yet? Oh, we've got an electricery. Well, that's not a problem. That's going to be a huge problem for trains. Um... Where's, the, where's a good line? I mean, I could just put a... I think that should power it anyway. There we go. And when we need to, once the power's all connected up, we can knock that down. That's fine. Good. So that's all connected now. I just want to see if I can drive a train. <laughs> oh, there's a train. But that looks like it's leaving, not coming in. Right, so let's just pause. Oh, a bit more. Pause. Can I get in this train? And can I see it? I can. Yeah. And then, can I wheel myself around? I can. Oh, you stopped. Pause. I just want to see if we can drive this train and see what route it takes. If it's coming to us, it may not be. It is. Oh, that's a heck of a corner, though. 36 passengers out of 1,280 on this train. Not too bad. It's kind of a sort of relaxed ride in. This is down by the reservoir. This is where we're going to have our dam and where I think we're going to put our water supply in. Pretty cool. Now it's going to go up and over the main motorway. A bit of a slowdown here. And then the long stretch in as it comes into the main station. We're getting some high rises going in over there as well now, which looks pretty cool. Just follow this in and then we'll leave it alone. It's strange it's deceiving how bumpy this land is in here. In he comes, changes platform. Thank you very much, sir. Off they get. Off come 36 people. I'm assuming tourists train disappears. Now, where do they go? Do they do anything? Oh, they're coming out. Here they come. Oh, they're coming straight to the bus stop. Oh, and there's a bus coming. On they get. Straight off the train, straight into a bus. Fabulous. It's exactly how I envisage that to work. <laughs> exactly how I want that to work. They will then come around here and be able to be dropped off at the main bus station. Which means that um, yeah, seventy-six out of ninety. Let's just see them get dropped. Whether they get dropped. That's the Witten line. Yep. So they might get out and walk. <laughs> it was easier for them. Well, this bus thing is not too bad in the end. I mean, it's still busy traffic-wise. But we have got public transport available for people, so... Sort of can't do an awful lot about it. The 64, including those that came off from that station, I think. Off they get. They all pile off. Ready to get their next onward journey bus onwards. Fabulous. Good. So that worked. So the train station is in. Um, plenty of trains coming in and out, taking people in and out. So we've at least connected that up. And there is a place for them to go. We've got 262,000 then. So let's have a look at Metro. I think um, this is 
it looks like there's less there now than there was before. Maybe that's helped a little bit. Not so sure. Let's just have a look at that electricity. Is that connected? It is. Might be able to get rid of those wind farms shortly. Right, anyway, over here we did see as we were driving around that we had an issue. This one is full. We're going to empty this one. This one we can put there, but can we open it up again whilst we empty the other one out? And these will do a loop around. Very good. So that's working again. Incineration state seems fine. Crematorium is available now, I think, actually. No, it's not. Not available for another couple of hundred people. Fair enough. Let's put over a crematorium over on this side, because actually these don't have any anywhere to put their dead at all, which is a problem. There we go. They do now. That will help with that a little bit. Witten Church. Wonderful. Now I'm inclined to bring these lines over, even though we can't buy that land yet, but I'm still just so I remember to do it. We're on straight, but it's on straight. There we go. Because that's where the line will go. So we may as well put it in, because then I'm going to know it's there. There shouldn't be any backlog at these stations either. How many train people are you bringing? 68. 66? 66. Yeah, okay. We're at 270,000. Let's look at the metro system. Oh, why are you not stopping? These buses, these trains arrive at the right time though for these buses. Look at that. Look at it. Streaming out. Get on a bus, get on a bus. They're all getting in their cars, though, some of these people. That annoys me. But look at the buses packed full of people coming in. Yeah, these buses are almost full. Fantastic. I'm really pleased with that, then. It's 275 extra people coming in. And these are just coming in from outside of the of the town. Now I wonder if they're coming hopefully to fill some jobs. Hopefully some of these people can't have, have no education. Ah, now this is what we've got a problem with. There's a dead person waiting for transport. Let's put in uh, a hospital. Uh, a hospital is not going to help me. A dead person is going to have to be one of these. Um. Okay. That will help over that side, and I'm going to put another one in over here in a little while when we put in the next piece of land. But we've got this, I mean, we have got four of them now, so one would hope that they should be able to cope with that. Are you full now? No, you're nowhere near full. Nowhere near full. What about you? No, nowhere near full. Just traffic slowing them down, maybe getting to places, who knows? Yeah, well, it certainly is true here. Right by the bus stop. Oh, okay. We'll probably have to move this then. I didn't realise that was my bus stop. Um, let's, can we move that? Uh, relocate. There we go. There we go. Because I want I want the uh, metro and stuff to go in here. Okay, well, let's do the metro. We keep talking about it. Let's do it. Metro. Metro. Right, we've pre paused the game. We're going to go straight in with the metro station right by the bus station. So we're going to go for one of these and one of these... Boom. It's in. And I'm going to put our stations in first, and then we're going to look at joining up all the lines. Um, and we only want to put stations as well where we have... Already occupied by what? Already occupied by what, precisely? Boom. Um... Then we're going to come round the corner. Oh, I suppose, actually, we could put one up. Here. Here. 
here. Must remember to put one in by the university, that's really important. Um, let's do that now while I think about it. Put the commercial shops there. One there. What are we on? 213,000. Let's have a look. One, two, three, four, five, six. We've got anything in Victoria apart from the university, so actually let's come across do that. Just want to destroy as little damage, cause as little damage as possible. dead person in it, we'll get rid of that as well. Then we can come down into downtown. By the railway station. Do we want to go into Cornfield? I don't think we will at this stage. Right. Now we've got to link these all together. So that worked. Um, can we curve these? We can. Money, you see, we're already starting to lose costing a fortune. Costing a fortune. All the necessary stations in there over there. Uh, we want to do a proper curve on this one, so we're going to go up to. Snaking it through the system. Like that. Um, or do I? Oh, I probably should have gone out to there, then round and down. Whoops! the refund. Give me the refund. Right, let's try that again. Like so. Then we need... with our last 24,000. Like that. And there we have a squiggly wiggly, very on the edge only, <laughs> transport line. Not the world's best. Metro line tool. So these are now all connected, one assumes. Well, we have st oh no, we have got to draw the line on though, haven't we? So let's draw the line. So create a new line from the bus terminal. 
Add stop. Add stop. Add stop. At the very least, this will enable people to get around the outskirts of our city. How much are we on? 17,000. Right, so that one's in. If we go to here, can I click on this now? No, it's just add stop at the moment. Go away. Then let's click on here. Metro line one. Here we go. So this goes uh, clockwise around, doesn't it? Really? So we're going to call this. Um, we've got a circle line already, haven't we? So let's call this the. Um, northbound because it goes from the bus station around and then back so this is the northbound line um, and we'll do that one red okay that's the northbound line and then what I'm gonna do go back into Metro back into the tool I want a new line from the bus station and this line is the southbound and goes around in the other direction. So depending on where you want to get to, southbound, southbound. There we go, that's the other one in. Uh, let's shut down that tool. Let's open up this one again. Let's click on the green. Well, I think we'll keep green. And then this is the southbound line. So we have... Which I forgot to press enter. Northbound line. And the southbound line. There we go. Metro line's in and go. Let's have a look and see this it work. Now, I don't know whether we could be happy to... Have we got power for all of these lines? Do we have to have more power? Power seems okay up there. Now we've got power. So here's, here's one of our trains. Hasn't got anyone on it. Eight hundred and forty people each these can carry. So, let's go above. So, there you go. You can see them moving around in a clockwise and anti-clockwise direction. So, if people don't want to take the um, buses, if they want to miss the buses, they can. And they can take the tube. Let's go above ground, because you obviously can't see them above ground. But, let's do that anyway. Let's turn that off. There we go. Let's just see if anyone's going to be using it. Because the metro... I, I say I probably should have put it here. Which is the other end, you know, because the people come out of there here first. Are they going to take the longer walk to the metro, or are they going to come out and go straight onto the bus? Because if I'd have put it here, they're already coming this way. They could have gone and fall down. Mm. Do you reckon I can move it? How much is it? Twenty-nine thousand. I wonder if I can move that line. Apparently. Seems a bit odd because it says already occupied. Just station. Oh, not that station. Forty-two. Let's put it in this side. Much better idea. Next, closer to the bus stop. Then let's combine. Oh, let's get our straight line to one. So that connects there. That connects there. Uh, let's go to our lines. Let's drag that to there. Let's put a stop here. Oh, why can't I put a stop in there? Good. So that now has a stop. I don't think that's going to have caused major problems to any of these lines. 
we just did a very expensive case but you see what I'm saying if they're coming out of here already the doorway is already close to this bus stop can't put that any closer to that because of the, the, fa the fact of the tile but it should allow them if they want to to do both Not quite sure let's just make sure our line is the same southbound line northbound line seems okay let's continue on and see what happens just need to wait for a train to come in and then we'll see we are already getting... Can I move? Can I take this apart now? I think I can. I don't think I need you anymore. Electricery. How much have we got on the system? <sighs> Electricity, water and sewage. Look. All, all on the edge. All on the line. When it comes a train, let's just see how many people are on this train. 114. 110 have just got off. Where do they go? Do they go to the bus stop? Do they go to the metro? Do they do a bit of both? Let's have a look. Definitely the bus stop, I think. Oh, Whee! We're a big city! What a great way to end this episode. We now get crematoriums if you put those in. And we can updo our uh, plant. We also have a new 2x2 coming up at land, which will allow us to connect up our railway line on the other side. So there we go, we made the big city. Not seeing anyone use my... Uh, Metro yet, which is unfortunate. But the bus buses are certainly taking our people easily from the station, though. So at least that's working. But there we go, ladies and gentlemen. We've done our trains are in. We shall finish them off, and we put a metro in today. Fantastic. Hope you've enjoyed the episode. If you have, please remember to leave a like. It means the world to me. Uh, just to see that you're enjoying what I'm doing. Um, if you want to leave any comments, please do so in the comment fields below. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow on our week-long adventure of City Skylines and Thursday for some more Skylines. And we'll probably end up having to deal with that uh, residential and commercial demand we can see below. But thanks so much for watching. You take care. And I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>